Hi, in this video, we'll talk about moving components in fusion. We'll cover both translation and rotation of the body. We can typically make use of this feature to change the location of parts in an assembly or visualize their alternative locations. To move a given component, all we need to do is right click on that component in the model tree. And once we right click, we can select on move slash copy. And once we do that, we can hover over that body and we will see this particular coordinate axis. And this is the local axis for this component. So if we drag it, if we drag this particular arrow, then over here, you can see that it has moved by 0.5 inch along its local Z axis. And this movement is relative to its initial orientation. Likewise, we can move this by any distance along any of its axis and we can also rotate it along any of its local axis so over here we can just input the rotation instead of rotating it manually and we also have the ability to input the translation and rotation in this particular dialog box. So if you input two inch over here, or uh, two is quite a lot, say we input 0.5 inch and 0.1 inch over here and say 0.25 inch over here, then it has been moved by all these distances along its local axis. And likewise, we can input the rotation angle as well. Then we can input any angle of our choice to rotate it. And yeah, that's all for this video. This is how we can move a particular component. I hope you found this video helpful and please hit like and subscribe. Thank you.